Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'll show you how to translate Neve's logo with Polylang. And first you'll need to ensure that you have two different languages set up. So for my example, I'll be using English and Spanish. We can see the two languages here. And also you'll need to ensure that you have two different logos. So I'll open up my media library and I'll show you the two logos that I'll be using for this example. So this one will be the default one. I've called it English logo. And I've also chosen English under language. And for the Spanish translation, we'll be using this N. I've called it Spanish logo and I've selected Spanish for the language. So now we can begin translating. Let's hover over languages on the left and click strings translations. So we already have the logo string on the page, but I'll still search for it just to filter out everything else. So if we look on the left, we'll see the string. I'll explain what it means. Light corresponds to the light theme color palette. 168 is the ID for the logo image. Dark is for the dark theme color palette. We have the logo ID again. And here we have same true, which means that we want to use the same logo for a specific language on both the light and dark color palettes. We can see our two translations here, both English and Spanish. We can also see strings for each language. So to translate the logos, we'll need to get the IDs. So I'll go ahead and open up the media library in a new tab. And now we can click on one of the logos. And if we look in the address bar, we can see some numbers at the end. This is our image ID. Now we can go ahead and get the ID for the Spanish logo. If we look at the top, we can see 382 at the end. So I'll copy this. And then we can go back to strings translations and under Spanish, we can paste this to replace 168 for the light palette and we can replace 168 for the dark palette as well. So both of our palettes will use the same image. And once we are finished, we can click on save changes. Okay, so now we can test it out. Let's go ahead and open our website in a new tab. So this is our English homepage with the default logo. So now we can click on the Spanish flag to translate this page to Spanish. And this is the Spanish translation with the corresponding logo. Okay, so you can now go ahead and translate your own logo with Polylang. Thank you for watching and see you next time.